Morgan. Ugh. I don't want to do anything. I hate everything. Me. <laughs> it is grey. It is raining. It's bank holiday. It's Monday. Not that would be different from my any other days, right? Because I'm unemployed at the moment. But <laughs> um, it's just ugly. I don't want to do anything. It's raining. I don't even want to go like to gym or nothing. So, I literally woke up a little bit ago. I haven't filmed anything, like anything, in uh, in the past week. Not gonna lie, we've been a bit depressed. I've been kind of rotting from Tuesday till yesterday in bed. I just basically ate. That was it. I obviously been looking for a job and thinking what's next and stuff. Still no really update for you guys, I'm not gonna lie, because we're still confused as well. We don't know what to do. So we meaning I'm myself. Me and my little brain. But it is what it is, right? Um it's almost twelve o'clock. I haven't eaten yet, so I'm gonna make breakfast, my porridge, I'm gonna make coffee. Then I'm gonna change and finally I will show you what I bought from H&M and yeah I was thinking should I do try and haul it should be probably nice that you can see it but uh, I'm not gonna lie I'm not feeling like doing it so I'm just gonna show you the bits tell you where I got them from the price roughly and that will be it um, I have two more parcels coming from H&M because there was an additional sale so I went a bit wild also I have decided that um, because let's face it I don't really understand fashion I don't really like it it seems like such a hustle so for me to feel comfortable and a little bit stylish I guess is the word like like look put together the easiest way for me is to wear it all black I love black color and it's not just because I'm fat fuck and it makes me thinner I don't think it does to be fair but it's just easy also I hate making decisions apologies I just burped <laughs> I hate to make choices, I hate to overthink, like I like to overthink and I hate it. So if my closet is all black, then I can easily just pick the trousers, pick a top, whatever and go. So we're gonna make my life easier. So yeah, order two more puzzles. I know I should not be shopping because obviously I have no job, uh, I should be saving money, but it's getting warm now like we have like 16 degrees and I have no like spring summer clothes because last year I was uh, basically wearing all my previous year and the previous previous year uh, clothes which is now like battered so I basically chuck it out when I was moving in September and then I had just my like winter basics and now I'm like well I have nothing so obviously you know girl got to do what I got to do and uh it's um shopping so yeah so this is kind of like the first part of what i bought for a spring summer 2024 and then we're gonna have a uh, part two which is quite exciting so yeah but i'm starving so let's make brekkie Right, time for haul. Um, oh, my hair are so 
freaking long. And also two colours, which I hate, but I can't be bothered to just dye it. I'm not gonna do it next week or something, but oh, I can't be bothered, honestly, it's the worst job ever. But I was thinking that maybe I will get my hair cut in Tokyo. Because I would pay for it anyways before I go for my trip. So I was thinking because I was seeing this account on TikTok and um, Instagram. And they do like this like nice really like wolf cards or butterfly cards. Like a bit shaggy with like you know lots of lace and stuff. And that's exactly what I, what I like. That's where I get lost on when I had the long hair. The full blonde one if you remember. And I really enjoy that. So I think I'm going to treat myself and get the haircut in Tokyo. I think it would be quite experience. Luckily that salon is uh, friend friendly. People like all the stylists are English speaking. So... It should be all right. So I think that's what we're going to do. Anyways, back to the main event. So I got myself a new pair of shoes from Superga. Superga. I don't know really how to say it. It's Italian, apparently. Um, as I said, I just want to dress all in black. So kind of this is kind of on brand with like a few light pieces, right? But because I'm going to be all black, I can kind of experiment with colors in like shoes and stuff. So I went for the classic style low one which is this one and it's like I would say it's like peachy color I don't think it's coral I think it's peachy so I got those ones uh guess how much I paid for them I'll give you a couple seconds so I got them on sale and they cost 17 pounds 17 pounds so obviously I am absolutely chuffed about it so that's gonna be my uh summer shoe which I can wear literally with dresses with uh, trousers, with shorts, even though I have no shorts, but I will get them. I actually seen a uh, long jean shorts in Tesco's in FNF, and they seem to be like really good quality, nice blue color. So I think I'm gonna get those because uh, first of all, I'm old now, and second of all, I'm a bit fatty fuck, and I can't have uh, short shorts because the chub rubber. So. I think I'm gonna get those, but we'll think about it. Uh, so yeah, so this is the shoes. Then I'm just gonna pull it how it is. Uh, I got a pair of trousers, so as you can see, just like with with a little stripe. They are super long. They are white as well, and they are in size large actually because the extra large were way, way too baggy. So got these ones. It's like really kind of light material. I think it's a little bit see-through as well. But, you know, once you have it on, you can't really tell. And that's going to be just like my summer summer trouser. So that's that. I think it was like eight or nine pounds for those. Then my sister was laughing um, and told me I should not keep it. But I do really like it. So it's this like a uh, little like cardigan or sweater. So it's in like beige color, super long sleeve. It's like ripped material, as you can see. And it has like this little knot detail and like a split. So it's more like, you know, when it's summer and then in the evening you get in the cold. So you just walk it over. You have obviously t-shirt underneath. Also, obviously you don't have to if you're a slim gal, but I do have to. So, and it's just like nice little, you know, I think it would be good for summer for the evenings or then like early autumn or even now like spring so that was that again that was like eight pounds i think um then i got a shirt so just very simple blue and white stripey one uh this is actually a size medium because it didn't have large but it's still kind of big on me. I think this they are, this is like oversized fit. So it's like, you know, I'm just going to try it if the medium going to fit or not. Seems all right. Uh, obviously, I'm going to have it open because I never really close my shirts. I love to have it kind of as a cover up. Because, you know, in summer, belly, you can see it from every angle, every side. And I'm just not comfortable with showing that all the time. So obviously, if it's hot, hot, I will take it off. But then if I can, I will just put like a little, little shirty shirt to cover. And and make myself feel more comfortable so yeah just got this one 
white and blue. I have nothing blue I realized in my closet and this seems to be kind of like the time uh, timeless piece. Um, is it? I don't even know what material it is. Let me have a look. Uh, it's 100% cotton so it's gonna be really good for summer and probably gonna wash really well as well and I have it for a while as all of my shirts I have for a while. So that's that. Then I got myself just a basic Hoodie, I already have this one in black. This is like charcoal gray, like really dark gray. It's not full black. Uh, I think it was like five or six pounds. And I'm gonna have it for my, uh, for the flight when I'm gonna be flying to Tokyo with uh, either leggings or joggers. I have still black joggers from last year when I went to Korea. They've been really comfy and I had the matching uh, hoodie, but I'm now wearing, well, sweatshirt, not hoodie. Uh, but I'm wearing the hoodie now and it's like kind of worn off so I just got myself a new one because I saw it was on a discount then two basics black t-shirts this one is kind of longer one small sleeves I like when it has like a short uh, tiny sleeves uh, quite high neckline so just super basic and then I got a crop top. I already have this one. I really like this cut again, short ones, and usually it hits really well with my high waisted jeans. So I just took up another one. I think both of the dishes were like three quid. So I got that one both in uh, large size. And then I actually ordered some stuff from Asda, George at Asda, and is this blouse this wrap around blouse i don't know if you can really see so it's literally like have a big v-neck and neckline and it's just checkered it actually does really nice like silhouette so i have my obviously white uh high-waisted black trousers and it kind of feels like it goes really nice kind of cinch you a little bit in a in a waist and i really really enjoy that one actually oh uh, the only thing i need to have like a safety pin to make sure that you can't see the bra i think it's a size 16 like it fits because uh, the sleeves are big and everything but i think obviously i need to either lose a little bit over my belly or just use the safety pin to keep it uh, secured and in place and that was actually five pounds from uh, george at asda and it's 100 percent cotton as well which i'm very like pleased because they're gonna last forever and also it's gonna be really nice um uh, in summer when it's hot so that's it this is so far what i bought for spring summer as i said i don't want to do any colors i have two parcels come in as well from h&m which i mainly have like a nice tops a couple trousers as well and i think like a jumpsuit like a long one for summer so obviously i'm gonna show you that as well if i'm keeping something obviously i'm gonna show you everything but if I'm not keeping it and if I look like an idiot in it, then there's no point to really share it with you. So, yeah, this is so far what I have in my new wardrobe. Um, and I guess that is it. So, today obviously is Bank Holidays Monday, so I'm just going to take it easy. I'm going to be chilling. Uh, I'm going to read my book. I want to finally finish it. So, because I do tandem reading, so I'm reading two books now in one go and it just annoys me now because I started the book I wasn't really into it so I was like okay let me start another one which I like but I'm trying to alternate so I'm gonna try to finish the one I like and then I will focus on the one that I'm not really keen so yeah and then I have a couple books as well ready to read next which I'm quite excited about so today's basically mission will be just uh, edit this video quickly um, because it should be this should be actually live in 15 minutes will that be no is it gonna be another late upload yes am i annoyed about it a little bit but could i wake up earlier film this quickly edit it and upload it i could have i done it absolutely not so you know i'm just do whatever i want <laughs> at this uh at this moment also I need to uh, I need to start really planning my Japan trip as well and I am thinking to do another trip 
as well. So we need to do just the logistics, yada, yada, yada. But I will share that with you. So we're definitely going to be traveling, even though I have no job. But that's okay. And yes, yeah, so we will see. Anyways, I hope you enjoyed this uh, video. If you did, give it a thumbs up. As be usual, if you're new here, subscribe. And I will see you next week with another video about my redundancy uh, update, my next steps, and what I'm doing or what I'm not doing. So, yeah. Anyways, bye.